everybody's got their favorite part of the cycle. There are people that love the wash, they love the rinse or the spin or the drain. I'm a spin guy, I love the spin. There it goes. My name is John Charles and I'm a washer collector, uh, enthusiast. Laundry day. <laughs> The club got started around 1987, I think, and now we have like 3,000 members from all over the world. But we get together for wash-ins. You do laundry till like four in the morning. You do your margaritas and your laundry together. The laundry. The laundry. The laundry. We watch the cycles. You'll see a lot of us just stand there and watch the whole cycle go through. Oh, oh my God. Everywhere. All 3,000 of us come in with a story like, I thought I was the only one. I thought I was the only person in the world that did this. In the collection, I've got 59 machines and I've got 22 hooked up and running down here in the basement. I have a good representation of everything that was made from 1938 to today. And I take them all apart and I restore them because I want to know how everything works inside the machine. And then the laundry is, for me, it's sort of like the frosting on the cake. These machines represent a lot of ways of doing things in each decade that change, that we no longer do. And I think it's something that should be preserved for other people, if we can get them interested. I just can't go to a cocktail party and say, how's your washer doing? They'd look at me like I was crazy. But I can get together with these guys, let my hair down. Uh, it's just so much fun to be able to have a conversation about it, because I know laundry's a chore for everybody else, but for us, it's, it's play.